From VOA Learning English, this is the Science Report. Strong economic growth in Asia has lifted millions of people out of poor economic conditions. But some environmental activists say it has also hurt the area's environment. The International Union for Conservation of Nature, the IUCN, met in Bangkok, Thailand recently for three days. The group urged Asian countries to work together to protect the environment. It warned that if they fail to do so, many plants and animals will become extinct or disappear forever. Asia produces about 40% of global economic activity and two-thirds of global growth. Experts say economic development has hurt the environment. More than 1,400 plants and animals are critically endangered. About 95% of Southeast Asia's coral reefs are at risk. And wetlands that once covered tens of thousands of kilometers of shorelines are disappearing faster than anywhere else in the world. Zheng Xinsheng is president of the IUCN. He says Earth's ecosystems are stressed and governments need to limit losses. He says we need to change how we produce and consume things. In Bangkok, the group urged governments, businesses, and non-government groups to work together to help the environment. IUCN officials say 2015 is a turning point for Asia. Their Asia Regional Director, Aben Marker Kabraji, says an urgent effort is needed. She says Asian countries need to take the energy that fueled 50 years of economic growth and use it to secure the well-being of both nature and humans. For VOA Learning English, I'm Carolyn Prasuti.